Hello everyone, welcome to the security channel. In this video, we are going to find the answer that we have for this equation. We have x over x plus 1 to the power of 2 plus x over x minus 1 to the power of 2 is equal to 6 and we want to solve this equation and find what value we can have for x. Before moving forward to talk about the solution, make sure that you pause the video to think about this problem and we will see you in about 15 seconds. Please consider subscribing to this channel and we will see you in a bit. To solve this problem, we are going to use a trick. First of all, note that a squared plus b squared plus 2 times ab is equal to a plus b to the power of 2. So instead of writing the first one to the power of 2 plus the second one to the power of 2, we are going to write it as the first one plus the second one to the power of 2 minus 2 times the first one times the second one. Let's do that. Then we are going to have x over x plus 1 plus x over x minus 1 to the power of 2 minus 2 times x over x plus 1 times x over x minus 1. Now if we simplify it, we are going to have 2 times x squared over x squared minus 1 to the power of 2 minus 2 times x squared over x squared minus 1 is equal to 6. Now we are going to use a variable like t for x squared over x squared minus 1. So the first component is going to be 2 times t to the power of 2 minus 2 times t is equal to 6 and if we simplify it we are going to have 4 times t squared minus 2t minus 6 is going to be 0. If we divide both sides by 2 we will have 2 times t squared minus t minus 3 is equal to 0 and if we solve it then t is going to be 3 over 2 or negative 1. Now let's put x to the power of 2 over x squared minus 1 as negative 1 and 3 over 2. For the first case if we simplify it we can see that 2 times x squared is going to be 1. So x can be plus minus 1 over a square root of 2. On the other hand for the second one we have x squared over x squared minus 1 is equal to 3 over 2. So x squared can be 3 and then x is going to be plus minus square root of 3. All these values can be answered and we have 4 answers for the equation that we have. Thanks for watching the video. If you would like to see more puzzles, maths involved activities and problems from different math competitions and Olympiads, please subscribe to this channel. This is the Security Channel. I hope to see you in the next video.